these are important not only for agriculture, uh, but for the entire uh, environment. So we're very concerned about the, the health of our hives in, in Hawaii. Well, bees are really important, but they're also part of our food chain. So it's, it has a direct impact on our food supply because the most valuable thing we get from bees is pollination. So for some crops, if you don't have an insect pollinator, you get no fruit. But now we have these two pests that w will kill your bees. The varroa mite is like a, a tick. Um, it crawls into the cell where the bee is developing and sucks on the blood of the developing bee. And the small hive beetle came last year and it is really a, a formidable pest. It can fly many miles, it can live over a year, and when it gets into a colony, the bees will chase it and try to corner it. Uh, but as soon as the bee's attention drifts, the beetle will crawl out and mate and quickly lay hundreds of eggs. And those eggs hatch into these little wormy maggots, and the maggots cause the honey to ferment, uh, they eat the larvae, they just grow exponentially in the hive in population. So you can quickly have thousands of maggots crawling all over everything. It's estimated that there's probably 10 to 15,000 honeybee colonies managed in Hawaii. Danielle's position is so important to the entire state. It's a worthy investment for us to continue our work in this area. The apiary program hopes to educate beekeepers so people that are already keeping bees can learn to manage these problems. But it takes new techniques and a new awareness. There's a lot of options, but it's starting from the beekeeper learning what the pest is and what kind of a threat it is to their colonies. Well, I've been traveling a lot to meet with beekeeper groups. There are hobby organizations where beekeepers are meeting to just learn from each other, and they've been very receptive for me to come and give them talks and, and tools and help them learn. One thing that you can do is plant habitat for pollinators. So planting things that bloom over, uh, over the seasons is really good for bees. Buy local honey. Those beekeepers could really use the support right now and uh, give it a try. I think the other part of the importance of bees though is not just for our agricultural crops, it's really uh, for our natural environment and for much of the pollination of our native species. So we're learning that you have to keep strong colonies and that means watching for varroa, watching for other diseases, giving your bees every chance to defend against the beetle. So there's hope for keeping bees healthy in Hawaii.